to another reaction video no other from cj the champ and i've said in my past video that we we're going to cover up these most disrespectful moments in anime history that he got lined up past if you haven't seen the other video number seven check that out like on it comment you know as always subscribe on the channel this is number six as you see in the title no wasting time we're gonna get into this all right let's get started because god no bro <laughs> This is when it just went from zero to a hundred. Whoa. This man's Popovich started. I remember him. Bro started to hit it with the combos. Hit put. Already know exactly where he going at with this one. We all seen this whole that, that ass whooping by my Fidel. Wow. I I knew that was gonna be one of them. Good check. Nigga. Oh, oh Lord, sweet Jesus. Somebody get in the ring and help this bitch. Yep. Yep. Let's get it. All right, ladies and gentlemen. It is finally <laughs> time for the most disrespectful six. in anime history six. The series that we observe some of the most outlandish, vile, and disgusting acts ever committed and to be seen by the human eye. And since this is episode six, why not put six moments instead of four? Because y'all be liking these long ass videos. I don't know why, but hey, I mean, if you like them, I guess I'll keep on doing them. But anyways, hey, but, uh, I like them. Get started. Oh my God. Here we right, go. Ladies and gentlemen, our first moment, Itachi Little Bro and Sasuke. Ah, yes, the time where we didn't know anything. The time that we thought that this man killed his entire clan for absolutely no reason at all. But anyways, as we know, Itachi and Kisame pulled up to the leaf, and they was not playing games, bro, before they even got to Naruto. This man Itachi put Kakashi in the nastiest genjutsu. He was stabbing this nigga for 72 hours. Bro, put this man on the stake. Absolutely torturing, bro. And he was like, oh my God. Don't give up on me now. We're just getting started. We still have 71 hours, 59 minutes, and 59 <laughs> <Damn>. seconds left. <laughs> and this man Kakashi like, oh, nah, bro. You telling me it's only been one second? Oh, shit, me. Oh, my God. Woo. So after he finished torturing this man for basically three days in the water, Sukiyomi, bro, pulls up on Naruto, and he's like, hey, what's good, little nigga? Go on and uh, huh, take a step outside for us real quick. Yes, that's <laughs> right. Mm, Sami had us drooling from the mouth. It can't wait to gobble you up and swallow you. Yoki Sami, shut the f up. I know, right? This nigga pain really parking <laughs> me with this zesty ass shark. Mm, you're such a buzzkill, Itachi. You have some fun. So then Sasuke pulls up and bro is absolutely livid. And this man Itachi like, oh wow, look who it is. If it is my adolescent pain in the ass little brother. <laughs> oh lord. Looks like you not that much of a bitch than the last time I saw your little punk ass. So this man Sasuke just rushes this man with a Chidori. But bro slaps his sh to the side and grabs his hand. And he's like, wow. <laughs> Is this all you got, little nigga? I really left your sorry wow. ass alive for this. So bro shatters his wrist and looks at him and he says, I have no interest in you, little boy. So bro kicks this man across the entire hallway and he got this man slumped sitting in tornado drill position up against the wall. Tornado and drill. <laughs> Sasuke got up again and started talking. So he started running at man. But Itachi was like, little boy, if you don't sit the down, and bro started beating him. And Naruto's just watching it like, oh my god. Yeah. He is beating his ass. <laughs> Thank God I don't have any family. Even Jiraiya's like, damn. <laughs> Could it be me? You gonna have to Couldn't be me. Jump me. Then Itachi picks this man up and starts choking him on the wall. And he says, oh, as weak as ever, I see. Looks like you still a little punk ass bitch. Allow me to remind you of that day. Oh, Lord. That's Hello? messed up. Hey, yo, where is everybody at? This better not be no damn prank. Nah, ain't no prank. Yo, what the fuck? Oh. Oh, God, why is everybody passed out right now? 
I'm talking about passed out. Oh, God, no. Auntie? Uncle? Oh, fuck. Oh, f the niggas ain't breathing. The <laughs> niggas dead. <laughs> I just teleported to this big ass fing door. Why am I shaking in my boots? Wait, wait. I don't even have my fing shoes. Why are my toes out? This dude. Nigga, are you blind? <laughs> I obviously killed these niggas. But, 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 but why? <laughs> oh, so little do you know, Sasuke. To save you the trouble, I'll start off with mother. That lazy, lazy wow. bitch. Always making me do the chores. Oh, oh, all over chores, yo, yeah, for real. Dishes, Sasuke, do you know how fucking old that shit gets? And with no allowance but but brother those are just chores Shut up. oops uh, no. and then father this lazy clown of a bum just the other day i caught him flirting with a red-haired woman from the uzumaki clan to say the least little brother he was cheating uh, I I I impossible no sasuke Nah. Now I shall make you watch them die for 24 hours. Really? <laughs> you smell that Sasuke? That Uchiha back is hitting. Bruh. Yeah. Hey, Itachi's putting that little nigga through the ringer. That's messed I, up. When I first heard about Cocaine Bear, I just remember thinking, it's a hell of a title. A bear? Cocaine? Okay. Hey, there you moment. go. Our next moment. Killer B dog walking Sasuke. <laughs> okay, bro, bro. I swear I oh, didn't Lord. mean to put Sasuke getting dogged twice in a row, but this moment right here, you knew when I first started this series, this was going to come eventually. But anyways, Sasuke and his new little ragtag crew, or basically what I like to call him Orochimaru's illegitimate children, decide to oh, pull up no. on B. Now this man B just vibing, bro. He's just chilling, relaxing, enjoying his day, throwing some bars out and sh And then his ops just pull up to his front door. Really? Hey boy, you the eight tails ginger kid, right? <laughs> Not just eight tails, Lord eight tails the fuck. What y'all niggas doing on my goddamn lawn, man? Simple. We're about to jump you. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I get this About situation. to jump him. But before we do that, though, y'all heard that new white spice? This move. <laughs> what? You thought I was playing? Oh, my God. This motherfucker. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't, yo. I can't with him. <laughs> Hey, bro, if you don't shut the fuck up, nobody ain't trying to hear that shit. Man, shut your hating ass up. You just mad because you ain't a munch. God, somebody hold me back. I'm about to suck the fuck out of this goofy ass nigga. Goofy? <laughs> Let me see. Through my telescope, I see one, two, three, four. Four goofy ah niggas on my front door. Hey, bro, how about we just quit playing and jump this Dr. Seuss Horton his who rhyming ass nigga? You ain't got to tell me twice, cut. So they just start jumping B and everybody's just getting molly -whopped. Bro started twirling the sword on his neck and was just whacking man like a Beyblade. He packed this man Jugo up so fast, the hell? threw him like a piece of trash, then proceeded to just start dissing him. So then Sasuke finally stepped up. He was like, all right, then, come on, run that fade, then. So they start doing oh, all the Lord. spinning and stuff. And then they end up stopping. And this man B pulls out a whole ass notepad and starts writing in the middle of a fight. Hey, bro, what the f What you doing? the hell? My bad, my boy. Hold on one sec. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that right there. <laughs> my bad, my boy. Are you I just serious? had to write down this fire ass verse before I cook your ass. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Yeah. No. 
No, 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 bro. This man took the time to start writing down a whole verse mid-fight. The straight up lack of respect is appalling. Imagine you fighting you good and you say, oh my bad, bro. My mama calling, can you hold real quick? Bro, stop the fade, cause he know he's still gonna whoop his ass. <laughs> nah, bro. Yeah. That is wild, that's just disrespectful as hell. That is so then this man starts using nine sword style and just starts running Sasuke's pocket. Bro is bagging up for his life. Even Sasuke like, oh God, my shark guy can't keep up with this nigga. So bro started tossing him around, countered his Chidori, and this dude was like, I like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Ooh. So then Sasuke gets bailed out for the first time in this fight. And I say first time because this man got bailed out multiple times this fight. So then he started <laughs> munching on Karin. So then they was like, all right, bro. There's only one the way hell? to beat this man. We just gonna have to jump him. So they started jumping him. And this man is still teeing off on him. Look at this movement diff. So they finally ended up landing Dang. a hit. So he dipped off for a minute. Bro was like, hmm, so persistent. Bum ass niggas, but we smoking that Zaza on this motherfucker. That Uchi hot pack be hit hard as a motherfucker. I don't even know what I'm saying right now, but. This dude. So bro goes eight tails, blasts these niggas off of the mountain. Sasuke tries to hit him with a gig jutsu, but bro bypasses it and gives this man the nastiest clothes. Like, bro, that nigga's throat wow. is gone. Shattered, eviscerated. That man's jaw is broken. And they like, oh my god, impossible. Sasuke's getting his pockets ran. Where the f is the plot armor, nigga? So then B goes into full on eight tails mode. Then he starts fighting Sue gets to win this big ass kaiju battle. So bro's like, who the f you the hell? Aquaman, nigga? I eat deep amphibian motherfucker. I got something for you. Oh, oh love. Bro, what was that? Oh, I think B hit him with that yeet bell. Oh my goodness, bro. He absolutely blasted this man. He literally turned this man into nut. Pause, but look at him. Even Sasuke like, oh what? We ran up on the wrong nigga. But I mean, we all know how this fight ended. That plot armor kicked in for Sasuke and he started burning man with a Matarasu. But come on, bro. We all know, bro, this man got whooped. If none of his crew was there, his ass would have been grass. Because the exactly. fact that this man took exactly. the time out of his day to write some bars down right in front of your face, then proceeded to whoop your ass? Nah, bro, you should have been six feet under. You should have been gone. Make this the last ad you ever see he with Adblock been gone. 360. Just head to Adblocker. All right, uh, next up on the program, Grim Jar right. running Ichigo's pockets. Well, I mean, since uh, oh, Lord. Back, why not put some somebody else's pockets gonna get brain? We need to acknowledge the fact that this man, Grim Jow, is a absolute smoke demon. I mean, you could tell this is a crazy ass nigga just by his last name, Jagger Jack. I can't even pronounce what? that shit. That's how you know he a demon. And look but at the way, face. Rico Mundo's most notorious op ended up pulling up on Ichigo and Rukia. And dog wasn't wasting no time. Bro was like, I right, listen up. Uh, which one of y'all the strongest? Like, straight up, like, don't waste my time. So, bro, straight up. This is Rukia in the stomach. Ooh. Ooh. She looking like, my stomach hurt. And Grimjaw like, oh, huh. guess it ain't your weak ass. Go ahead and uh, move to the side for me, will you? So then Damn. Ichigo tried to attack him, but bro stopped it with his wrist. And bro's like, bruh, if you don't get this fat ass butter knife off of me. Hey, bro, for <laughs> real though, uh, when you gonna use your bankai? Huh? Like for real, bro, come on now, transform. You bullshit, you wasting time. Now come on now, chop chop before I put a hole in your ass like that bitch over there. So they started to get the scrap and this man Ichigo oh, like, no. he could just not keep up at all. Bro grabbed his sword mid swing and looked at him like, really? Is this really? your Bankai nigga? Man, if you don't get this sorry ass shit out of my face. Bro was for real throwing mans like a ragdoll. Then he read this man's movement like a book, grabbed his sword mid swing again. Then he kicked the life out of bro, made him do a whole 360. And he sent mans flying wow. backflips and shit. Made him run a red light. Then mans blitzed him. He said he ran a red light. And Ichigo looking like, damn. Maybe this soul reaper life ain't for me. <laughs> but no, no. You see, it just got worse wow. from here. Grimjow it did? started walking him down, picked him up, and started laying the hands on him. Like, yo, it got so Ooh. bad. He started playing this sad-ass music in the background, and Ichigo was just thinking about his life. 
Wow. Right in front of him. Damn. I guess I'm just not him right now. So you can pay more. Dang, yo, Ooh. for real. God, dog, boy, that all you got? You was not big creeping. You sure you the protagonist? Because that was a little too easy, my boy. He lost the eye. Hey, boy. Time to go home. Oh, shit. Tosin. What's your blonde black ass doing here? Hey, bro, I was mad. I ain't gonna hold you, cuz. We gotta get back to base pronto. Shoot, all right, then. Hey, hey, before I leave, though, hey, boy, you best remember my name, the Waco Mundo Demon. You best come back and get it back in blood, or else you a bitch. Good God. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, next up on the program, Spopovich rocking Vidal's world. Oh, yeah, my God. I I'm bringing this one out, bro. Like yep. I said earlier with the B one, this was just inevitable. Ladies and gentlemen, the most brutal beatdown in anime history. So as yes. we know, it's the World Martial Arts Tournament and Videl has to fight Spokovich. And yeah, <laughs> something was wrong with this shit from the jump. I mean, look at this. Nigga. Look at what this dude. Like a buff ass crackhead with an M tattooed on his head. So mm -hmm. they started fighting, but Videl was team off on man. It looked like easy money at the beginning. But at the beginning, was terribly wrong. Bro yep. was not going down at all. And I love how Goku and Vegeta were the first people to notice something was wrong. Goku looked at this like, yo, you seeing this shit right now? Yeah, yeah they seeing it. Hey, they ain't going to do nothing. Kind of <laughs> I think I'll go. Bro. So, of course, this man Gohan was oblivious. I was like, yeah, that's yes. my girl, y'all. <laughs> you got this, boo. But then. <laughs> and see the thing about it that's how he was in the end of damn show that's exactly how he was you got it you got it and i'm like bruh your dad and your um yeah your uncle they both know that something's off with the power level and you know if they know he should have had known too but his ass was all yay you got it you got it i'm like bruh you know something was off with that. Everybody else knew everything else was off. How the hell you didn't know? You supposed to be protecting your girl. Goku said, yo, she should quit right now. Wait, dad, what you mean? Yeah, Goku, what the f*** you mean about that? Krillin, shut the f*** up. I'm talking to my I know, son right? right now. Gohan, tell your girl to quit right now or you gonna regret it, my boy. Look at her, she's getting her shit. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, girl, you best get the f*** up. I ain't letting no pussy ass bitch made my son. Yeah, that's right. Tell her, Chi-Chi. So then Videl starts flying, right? So then Gohan started to get happy again, but then this man Goku said, hm, stupid idiot. She should just fell out the f***ing ring. Dad, come on, bro. You've been gone for seven f***ing years, and you already caused the problems and shit. Yep, and guess what? I'm still your daddy, bitch. Father knows best. I know, right? Look at him, Gohan. He doesn't even look sane. So then Videl kicked this man's head so far. His head did a 180. But then bro got back up and fixed his head. Nope, nope, nope. Yep. This is when you should have quit. You should have quit. Bro. Yep. This is when it just went from zero to 100. This man's Popovich started whooping. Bro started to hit it with the combos. Hit, put, good check. Nigga. Oh, I lost Good God, boy. Yep. Then bro started hitting her with more combos. Then he broke her back. Bro started beating her. No, bro, and been beating her face here. Bro picked her up again and said, <laughs> And everybody in the crowd can't watch no more. Everybody like, hey, yo, just stop the fight, bro. Then he hit her with the nigga. Oh, my God, bro. GG, GG, GG. <laughs> G -G. Game over, nigga. Then this man Gohan just started getting <laughs> mad, bro. But Goku was like, I, 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 don't do it. I told you to tell her to quit, but he didn't want to listen to me. Now you're going to have to watch it. Bro, yep. This was just terrible. Bro started stomping on her head. Stomping on her head and all that. Yamu came in and said, Hey, Spoba, bitch. Quit playing with a little stupid ass and uh, just go ahead and kick her off the ring. Oh, man. Oh, oh it's over. Thank you, baby Jesus. So then Gohan came <laughs> out, and this man, Spoba, bitch, looked at him like, <laughs> Hell does I'll see you later. That yo girl got her back blown out by me before you. Dang. A lot of people don't know this, but Come if you on, have man. a YouTube app on your phone, you could be using it to make up to. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, next oh, up, boy. Ayana Koji body in class C. 
So this man Ryun, right? He okay. got old girl up in here getting tortured. Bro pouring this cold ass water on her in this cold room. Trying to give her hypothermia or something. And he throwing that sh Lord, somebody please come and help this little girl. So they trying to get this man Ayana Koji to come out because he's a mastermind of his class. So bro pulls up outside of the place and this big ass nigga, God damn, what the f is they feeding you? What are you doing Ooh. at some random high school in Japan? Take your ass and I don't know where you want to go, the NBA or the NFL. I mean, shit, you could choose, my nigga. You want to play linebacker or you want to play power forward? And his name is Albert? Oh, what? Oh, no, don't make me do it, bro. <gasps> hey, hey, hey. Oh, man. It's bad. <laughs> no, it ain't no <laughs> fat. It ain't nothing fat. It ain't nothing fat, Wait a damn minute. Ain't no way in hell you the mastermind. Bitch, should I say that you can speak while you wouldn't miss in my presence? Uh, uh, no, no. That's right with all that jibber jabbery shit. Shut the f up. So I got this text message that one of my tools from my toolbox has gone missing. What? Really? Hold on, tool? Yes, <laughs> tool the f You know, goodness and well, I've been using her since day one. I literally set her up to get jumped, watched her get her ass beat, then blackmailed her right after it. Hey, bro, that's kind of devious. Yes, I know. Cause I'm a devious ass nigga. All right, bro, you may be devious, but uh, you about to get jumped. <laughs> jumped? No, you see, you got it all wrong. Because all of you have fallen into my trap. I personally am about to be all of y'all asses with no effort. Please don't jump my baby. Come get your ass off me. <laughs> okay, I like you, boy. Hey, sick him and take his turn. <laughs> oh, no, here we go. I'm about to bring you back. Oh, oh, just wait, Jesus, help me. <sighs> hey, hey, hey. Come on, boy. We Albert, you best with that nigga ass, you D1 prospect. <sighs> I am the Koji Koo. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh. <laughs> Do that. Dang, man. Oh, not bad. He just beat Albert, a D1 prospect going to Alabama to play linebacker. So which one of y'all next, Mrs. Boldcut or you, f nigga? <laughs> I know Cabrera. I mean, it's hey, good. Right in that mouth. You sleeping. Now, it's just me and you, fuck nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come in for my fate. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> come on, bro. Don't tell me they hyped you up all this time just to be trash. <laughs> Bitch ass nigga, stop playing with my name. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you like that? I got you pinned on a wall. If you don't stop talking with your hot ass breath, get your unhygienic ass off me. Wow. Perfect. Oh. <laughs> I fucked with the wrong nigga. So yeah, this yeah, man you did. just got humbled real quick. Bro took Top Mountain and just started beating him. But while bro was getting the sense beat out of him, he just started rambling about like just feelings and stuff. Bro was like, how do you feel, huh? How do you feel? And this man, I and Koji looking at him like, uh, excuse me, but uh, the f are you talking about? Why I know, right? show any emotion to get some weak ass trash like you? Just go ahead and just shut your mouth. I know, right? Yeah, he gone. But nah, I and Koji beat the soul out of this nigga. Beat him physically and mentally. Look at him after the fight. Bro looking like a Debbie Downer. All his spirit is just gone. Bro got his ass beat so bad he was about to drop out. And then you got a girl right here like, eh, bro, what you, where's the man I used to Lord, know? here we go. Man gone, shorty. I'm a different man now. Ah! Really? Bitch ass nigga. You ain't worth it. Really? Ma'am, this little Martinez motherfucker is out of control and he needs to be put down now. Jerome, calm down, I know. That's why I'm calling him. Him? Who is him? Jerome, you know exactly who I'm talking about. Him. Oh, oh, oh God, ma'am, oh hell no. Yes, that's right, Jerome, him. And we don't even have to call him because he's already here. In the hey, world hey, the is fuck? this? Oh, hell no. Hey, yo, when did this big ass Decepticon ass nigga get in here? Oh, Jerome, he's been here the whole time. He's just so powerful. You can't even sense his presence. Wait, what? Th that, that makes no sense. <coughs> Jerome, can you process anything with all that chrome in your fucking dome? This is an anime, nigga. Nothing makes sense. Capiche? Adam, get your ass up. Time to go to work, you fool metal, nigga. Take Jerome with you. <laughs> 
I'm not an alchemist, bitch. So just call me Fool Nigga. Fool Metal Nigga. Really? Fool Metal Nigga. Oh God, why did I sign up for this job? Stand back, Jerome. <laughs> you see, my evil plans. This dude got three Shut eyes. Mouth, ugly. Oh, oh, Adam Smasher, please help me. Excuse me, but who the f are you? Pardon, <laughs> you ugly three-eyed looking nigga. You best shut the up before I put a mother bullet in your mouth. Let's go. Please. Did I tell you not to speak? He gone. So you're the full metal nigga, Adam Smasher. Damn right, boy. And you're a nobody. Do you want to know why you're the main character of a prequel? Simple. Because you don't make it to the actual game. Huh. That's bullshit. Really? Okay, let's not waste any time. Just shut the fuck up and let me make you a pack. Five minutes later. Wow. Oh, baby, you so fine. When we get back to the crib, I'm beating up them booty cheeks. Welcome back here, Romeo and Juliet. You star cross sons of bitches. Shakespeare made you a pack and so will I. Oh my god, y'all made it. Now get in the car so we can have our happy ending. Lord have mercy, making me go through all this shit for your dumb ass. Oh, oh snap. <sighs> Foolish girl, trying to challenge me. You see, here's what I'm going to do to you. Oh, I am no. about to teabag the shit out of you. And drag <laughs> my metal chrome nuts across your fucking forehead. Oh Not my god. But I have a reputation and a name that I have to keep a good stand. Oh my god, Adam, here we go. Smash her. I know, right? <laughs> wow. Woo! Oh, Martine has come out to play. Oh, Don't you oh. want to end up like your little girly friend? What's up with the eyes? Made to a piece of meat. <laughs> Can't even show the body or else I'll probably get a guy line strike. You big king too soon to be. <laughs> you play. Your metal cheeks are mine. Wait, you have a saying devastating? Damn right, little nigga. You think you special or some shit? I told you, you're just a prequel character. Dang. I'll get you on the ground. Now get ready to bend over. Oh, hell no. <laughs> are you trying to hack me, bitch? I have two step authentication. Fuck off of my server. I know, oh, right? Access denied. <laughs> Woo. Where the hell do you think you're going, pussy nigga? Get the fuck off of my screen! Eat my middle dick! Ooh. Look at you. You're just scrap. I told you you wouldn't make the main game. Your sorry ass will just be remembered as a drink in the bar that nobody Wow. <laughs> at, at least my jacket is a DLC. Yeah, like anybody's gonna wear that shit. Eat a dick. Really? Wow, like he basically just went all in on this one. Wow, that's that's about closer to being better than the no 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 no. Only reason why this one is a little bit a little bit longer because he had more animes to cover. But the last one, number seven, if you haven't checked that out, check that out. Then come back to this one. But other than that, I mean, bro, like this dude, boy. <laughs> He bringing up all the moments. I'm going to tell you that right now. I approve it. But stay tuned for more videos. Cause I'm Like I said, I'm going to run down all these disrespectful moments and the integrity. Because number seven is here. I did seven. This is number six. So I'm going to run back five, four, three, two, one. And just stay tuned. And when you get that notification, you know, come click on it and come watch it with me. Other than that, 
i see you in the next video make sure you like comment subscribe hit up the gaming channel i'm out this thing